Hi, babies. Mwah. Okay, so today we're going to talk about supporting people and how it's not fake. If you have friends or family members that say things like, well, I just keep it real and I'm not, if I don't agree with something, I'm not going to pretend to agree with it. And if you're one of those people, I'm talking to you. Here's why supporting people isn't fake. Um, somebody leaves their spouse. You don't get to say, well, I always thought he was a nice guy. Or, well, I thought she was very sweet. Or when somebody shaves their head, you don't get to say things like, oh, but your hair was so pretty. It took you so long to grow it. Absolutely is not true, but whatever. Somebody quits their job without another job lined up. You don't get to say things like, so what are you going to do? Somebody decides to move across country. You don't get to say things like, I mean, you can, but you shouldn't. Say things like, are you seriously thinking about moving there? Because supporting people is free. Supporting people is about the person. And when you authentically love and support people, then you actually support them and their choices for their life. Why do so many people have success within my programs? Because I absolutely, authentically love and support them and the choices they make for their lives. Because any reservations that most of you have are about your fears, your limited beliefs, and your own triggers. It has nothing to do with other people. Example, you tell your mom you quit your job. I quit my job. Well, what are you going to do? Right? Fuck you mean. Your only response is, wow, that's really brave. I'm really proud of you for honoring yourself. They don't have to give you strategy, next steps to appease your anxiety and why you would never do that thing. Um, the only thing when somebody is giving you these kinds of information that you that you're supposed to do is hold space and love and support. And I need everybody to understand that we're really in the season when you don't provide those things, motherfuckers are cutting you off. We are in the season of it don't matter if we share blood, it don't matter how long we've been friends, it don't matter if we work together. If I come to you with what I'm doing and my choices for my life and you don't love and support and hold space for me in an authentic way, you are the weakest link. We are all making room for authentic connections. So we will let you go and we will replace you with people that can hold space and love and support us.